Hello. It may not be completely frost-free overnight, but overall it's pretty mild, certainly compared to the last couple of nights. A bit of rain here and there across parts of northern Britain. Further south it's dry, and with lighter winds here, well, we will see a few fog patches. The winds, though, are far from light across the far north, quite gusty here. We have a weather front bisecting the country. That's bringing cloud and drizzly rain over northern England, north Wales through the evening. And then a band of rain peps up as it crosses through Northern Ireland. So turning a bit soggy here through the second half of the evening. And then that band of rain will work its way across Scotland. So an hour or two of wet weather here through the early hours. Further south, it is largely dry. And uh, although it could turn pretty chilly before that wet weather arrives in northern Scotland, for most, we're well above freezing to start Wednesday. But there could be some fog patches around across the south. Just bear that in mind for the morning commute. Should clear, though, as the breeze picks up. And it will be another breezy day, particularly in the far northwest. Rain clearing from Shetlands, but uh, likely to see some outbreaks of rain at times over the Highlands and the Western Isles. For most, though, it is dry and we should see quite a bit of sunshine across parts of the south and the east and to the north of hills as well with the breeze coming up from the south. So north coast of Wales, north coast of Northern Ireland, the uh, Murray Firth may well see some decent spells of sunshine. And with the winds wafting up from the south, they're bringing relatively mild air too. So temperatures, well, quite a bit higher than they have been recently. 9, 10, maybe 11, 12, possibly even 13, where we see some lengthy spells of sunshine. So uh, really quite mild. But it is still February, so temperatures will drop through the evening where we have clear skies. Again, a fair bit of cloud across northern Britain and a couple of areas of thickening cloud in the far northwest. A couple of weather fronts here bringing a little bit of patchy rain. But those weather fronts get pushed away to the north. High pressure is controlling our weather. It's not sitting right across us, but it is keeping things largely dry through Thursday and Friday. And increasingly warmer air will get wafted our way through those days too. By Friday, there's a lot of isobars on the charts, so the winds will be picking up. But as I say, those winds are bringing relatively mild air. So it may start a bit chilly on Thursday. Again, there could be some fog around, but for most, it's a dry day. There's that weather front still bringing some rain to Shetland and the Western Isles for a time, but it does clear through. Most places dry on Friday with uh, a fair bit of sunshine by the afternoon. And where we see some sunshine, well, those temperatures again climbing a little bit higher, easily 11, 12, maybe 13 or 14, possibly even 15 degrees in one or two places. Again, with southerly winds, it'll be northern parts uh, north to the north of hills where we're likely to see some of the highest temperatures. And it's likely to be pretty mild again on Friday, positively spring-like, you might say. Uh, more details, as always, on the Met Office website, through our app, or, of course, follow us on social media.